I can't start a series on the voice of God without calling you to some fidelity, some loyalty that says, Lord, I don't want to hear you because I want to prosper. I want to hear you because I want to know you. Yeah. Whoa. And if I know you, I trust that the outcome of my life, the fruit of my deliverance, what you do with my story is going to be bigger than what I hope. I've got to know you. This is what went wrong with the charismatic Pentecostal prophetic movement. We start stirring gifts in people beyond their knowledge of God. Activating people in their ability and they still had no identity. And so what happens is they started to get little different things to do and still didn't know who he was. So then they started trying to speak for somebody they barely even know. Oh.